include everything. All right, guys, let's get back to it. Back to back. Control the village's entrance, but stay defensive. So let's just jump right in. So the villagers must survive, and we have to eliminate the ogres. It seems pretty straightforward. Um, so basically, we just want to stay in this circle here. We want to make code so that the guy attacks and he returns back to center if the enemy's dead. So they set up some code here for us. Let me turn the music back on. So while this is true, we create an enemy. If enemy, we want to uh, have our hero attack the enemy. And because most of these guys die with two attacks, we want to do it twice. Else, we want to move back to the 3934. No, it's kind of loud right now. Uh, 4034. So let's go ahead and change. Let's see what this, how this is going. So, bam, bam, move back to center. Bam, bam, move back to center. Bam, bam, move back to oh. Oh, uh, let's see here. Alright, looks like it's gonna work. So we'll go ahead and submit it. Bam. Lay out a few fools. Lay them out. Alright, cool. Alright, let's continue on here. Uh, ogre encampment. So we're going to use basic syntax, arguments, strings, variables, while loops, and if statements. Just going to move forward here. Break open the chest. Alright, so it wants us to attack the chest. Alright, so if there's a chest, uh, if there, if there's an enemy attack it, else, so here, so we'll say if Okay, create the variable first. We'll save our enemy equals find nearest enemy. And then we'll say if there is an enemy. So if an enemy exists, we want to attack him twice. So hero. Actually, we'll just do this attack, enemy twice. Attack, enemy twice. We could actually leave. We don't need the else in here. This is gonna run this and then do this anyhow. So, uh, no, I think we can just submit it. Let's see here. So, oh, we might have to increase our armor though. All right, so it's time to go back to the. Let's back it up. We'll go to the item store right now. So we. Let's see. What do we want to get? Uh, let's see if this should be enough. All right, let's go back to the level. We need to equip our shield though. All right, this should make us a little bit tankier, and we're gonna block some damage now. So basically, forty percent of those attacks aren't gonna register, depending on how well RNG Jesus loves us. All right, let's go ahead and submit this. Let's see. We don't do a whole ton of damage. If for some reason, I think it should work. It's looking like it's working pretty hard. The other route we could have done was increase our attack. Oh, it looks like we just got a new weapon and a new helmet, maybe? Let's see what we're working with here. Sudai, wristwatch, and the longsword. Not too bad. All right, let's do one more. Uh, woodland cleaver. So let's take a look at the new items that we got. So, 
this is going to, the wristband here is going to give us an ability that checks if an action is ready to be used so that's our is ready and this is going to give us the cleave ability so if i remember correctly the cleave ability is a aoe like attack so it's a skill obviously if you could do it as much as an attack it would be a little overpowered so you know you gotta you gotta wait on it so is ready cleave so we're gonna pass in the string and the cleave is gonna be the ability that we're passing in else we want to attack so we want to use cleave on cooldown essentially so if it's ready we want the hero to cleave the enemy else we just want the hero to attack the enemy so hero's gonna move to this set position while this is true we're gonna find a nearest enemy if the we don't care if an enemy exists even if the cleave ability is ready go ahead and cleave it and so we'll cleave the enemy right here and then we'll say else hero to attack enemy so I think we should be good with this so move here cleave attack attack so we cleaved again after 10 seconds one final cleave not too shabby uh, it looks like we're getting a new item as well just when I bought a shield probably a new shield I don't know man why do they do this to me uh, yeah run shield alright um, all that wasted gold so up next is backwood standoff I believe dueling grounds is a multiplayer arena go ahead and check that out I'll probably do it once at the end of the video um, but in the next video we'll do backwood standoff see you guys then as always, thank you to anyone who supports me on Patreon. Uh, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for following. And I'll see you guys next video. Appreciate it. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and share and support me on Patreon. Check out wayup.com. It's a great way to find full time jobs, internships, part time jobs, and one time freelance work for the college student. All you need is a .edu email. It's completely free, and you'll help me out in the process too. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.